Hey guys, here for another WWE 2K15 video here I'm covering the 2K Showcase which is one of my favorite features of this game I gotta say, really really loving it a lot because it's basically like a story You're basically playing like a story mode um, of true events Things that really really happen in the ring dur during these two eras Cause on um, the Showcase you can actually play two different eras uh, the era where John Cena had the feud with um, CM Punk when CM Punk did the pipe bomb you know the awesome um, uh, speech that he had you know the great storyline and everything uh, you got that storyline which covers like I think like 10 fights something like that I can't remember how much is it but in between the fights you they cover everything that happened in real time you know it's like a, it's like a documentary which is awesome and at, then after that you do the matches like you're going to see in this video you're going to see a couple cutscenes um during the fight that are cutscenes that really really happen during the if you saw these fights on pay-per-view or whatever they really happen which is something awesome that I like that they did here uh, there's also a second um, storyline that you do is the, the feud between Shawn Michaels and Triple H uh, that feud is also here that covers I think it's like two years of, of footage and fights that you're gonna fight here with, which is awesome as well and I haven't started that yet so right now I'm on this feud right here which is this storyline with CM Punk and John Cena which is awesome so far I think I've been playing like uh, five fights already I think this is the fifth no, I think this is the fourth fight of the storyline and there's still like more than five more fights in this to complete this storyline so i'm gonna come back at the end so i hope you guys like the video you know no superstar in history draws the emotion out of the wwe universe like john cena he's so polarizing yeah but you know there's one thing you have to remember when listening to this one particular crowd we are in bizarro land tonight yeah it's canada good god is he pressing a secret button to move that fast I mean, those kicks won't give you a good feeling. I can promise you that. He reversed it. Good move there. John Cena has made it clear that he does not respect the way that Alberto Del Rio became WWE Champion. Saying that because of his money in the bank briefcase, he lucked into the title. Well, come on. That's the point of the briefcase. To be in the right place at the right time. Alberto Del Rio earned that advantage when he won the Money in the Bank ladder match last month. From that. Of course, nobody can. Oh, oh. Look at this! Look at this! Cena went for the AA! And Punk elbows to the jaw! Fighting out of it! And he continues those elbows to. to Cena's jaw! Cena's reeling now! Yes! Punk with a big knee to the face! And the cover hooks the leg! Oh my gosh! This could be it for Cena! CM Punk, here we go. CM Punk is pulling forward in this match. And that's it. He gave everything he had, but it just wasn't enough. You can say all you want to about CM Punk, but in my book, he just... And he's heading back inside the ring. Uh-oh. What's CM Punk going to do now? CM Punk is so well versed to not only strike you with his hands, but his feet too. Oh, and the reversal by John Cena. And he gets back in the ring. What a reversal. He was able to reverse that. I don't know how he can counter this. I don't know how he's going to get out of this here. I don't believe the destruction we're seeing. This guy's just going from one painful move to another. Watch it, John Cena. It's been an incredible match. Oh, 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 oh. Cena with the shoulders down. Could be in here. And Cena stays alive. On a roundhouse kick from Punk. Let me do it. Cena may be finished. Punk signaling. Time to go to sleep. And Punk could be closing in on the championship. CM Punk could be closing in on the championship. Cena's out, Ken. No doubt about it. 
He's got a the GT. CM Punk! This isn't what? over yet! That's what Triple H had said. Oh, oh look at this! The AA from Cena! Hook of the leg! Oh my god! And he got it! Cena wins it! Alberto Del Rio on the number one contender. Now Del Rio trying to send a message to John Cena here tonight. Cena, I don't think he knows where he is, Ken. Oh, look out! Oh, oh, and right to the back of the man. head. A vicious attack by Del Rio. And it continues. Somebody's got to stop this. And speaking of somebody, look at this. Yeah, there's John Laurinaitis. Uh, he's in charge tonight. Remember, King, he was the one who, uh, who told Triple H Nash had been in a car accident. Triple H left the building, leaving Laurinaitis in charge tonight. Well, I think Laurinaitis lost control of this night. Long time ago. He's lost control again because look at Del Rio. Come on, Laurinaitis, get him off of there. Del Rio not having any of this. He is determined to destroy John Cena. Oh no, watch out, watch out! Oh my god! Laurinaitis has got to get some control over Alberto Del Rio. Awesome, that was a good beating Alberto Del Rio laid out. <laughs> Uh, and the great thing about all these cutscenes that you see right here is that all this really, really happened during the pay-per-views um, that they're portraying here on this game of the showcase feature, which is awesome. That's the great thing I like about playing this showcase because you're like reliving everything that you actually saw years ago, which was a very good era. Um, also. You know, this is by far one of my favorite features of this game, like I said before. I've been trying my career, and honestly, I don't like it. I do not like my career. It's very, very, I don't know, very boring, very stripped out, you know. There's no cutscene whatsoever. You, you can barely see any cutscene during the game, uh, so it's not the same career mode, something like we used to see a couple of years ago. I can't remember which one was it, that you actually played a career and your character actually was involved in different cutscenes and all that and different storyline story line backstage which was awesome um, but the my career here I'm still playing it I'm trying to get better because uh, remember you gotta start from scratch then build your character and it's it gets kinda hard but it's boring too it's boring I don't like it too, that much so I stopped playing the my career and I'm not going back to my career until I, until I finish um, these two uh, storylines in my showcase which is uh, this one and the Shawn Michael versus uh, Triple A's H storyline, which is I, I bet it's gonna be awesome. So I hope you guys enjoy. I'll be back at the end. He was able to reverse that. The last time the WWE Championship changed hands here in Buffalo was back in December of 2008 when Jeff Hardy defeated champion Edge and Triple H in a triple threat match at Armageddon to capture the title. That is actually the only other time Buffalo's played host to a WWE title change. Yeah, and back to Buffalo quickly, they have actually never seen a World Heavyweight Championship change. Incredible move by John Cena. Alberto Del Rio has to be learning now what it means to be in a championship match with John Cena in his never say die attitude. Oh, you're right about that. This match is truly emblematic. Counter. And did you hear the impact on that kick? John Cena with a nice reversal. A 
John Cena is like a machine on Alberto Del Rio right now. It's got to be taking its toll on Del Rio. This match is all about which man will continue the heritage of the illustrious WWE title. Will it be John Cena or Alberto Del Rio? Well, it looks to me like it might be John Cena at this point. He'll do everything he can to give integrity to the WWE title. Down goes Cena. With a cover now, in an easy kick out. Don't expect a lot of mercy to be shown here. Oh, big right hand. Oh, what a counter. What a counter. Lateral, and he doesn't stay down for long. With the championship at stake, you know these superstars will give everything they have to win here tonight. He was one step ahead on that one. John Cena with the offense. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. And this has got to be it. Yeah, one, two, one, two and three. three. Woohoo! That's it. <laughs> There it goes. So I won this match. Very awesome. Very cool gameplay. I gotta say I'm liking this uh, showcase. Um, let me know, guys. There you go. I got a trophy there. Let me know if you guys want to see fights from the other era, which is the Shawn Michael and Triple H one. Let me know. Thumbs up. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Till next time, guys.